It was Mikael next. Yes. Thank you. Can you hear me? Yes. I would like to ask, uh, first of all, much love to you all. Uh, much love. Normal stay. Normal stay. Uh, I would like to ask, uh, how do you count time? Uh, do you have a universal uh, time for for this year? Or do each race count time in their own way? Okay. Our perception of time is slightly different than yours. We can actually control where we want to be at whatever time that we need to be through different dimensional portholes. Not only that, but we can... It, it depends on the question. If, are you talking about for us personally or for our ships? Because they have a different time as well. We can fold space and time and move hundreds of thousands of years into one or two hours. So time does not exist the way you see it in that realm. Do you understand? <clears throat> not quite. Can you elaborate a little bit more? So there is no universal time. linear time. They are of one. They are a fabric that work together. Time and space can be folded from one point to another, so that at this point it is one point in time, and at the other edge of it, it's another point in time, which may be very different than the original. Do you understand? It is very, it's a very difficult thing to describe without using scientific terms. Excuse me, are they simultaneous? Yes. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Yes, thank you. But they move as one. You can move them as one because as you move from this place to this place by folding the fabric of time and space, it will appear that you are many, many millions of miles from your original destination, which with a ship would have taken many millions of years or thousands of years and then it only takes maybe an hour or two. Okay, thank you. Did you have a question? No, sorry, excuse me. That's all right. Did that answer your question? That is one kind. Are the, the time that we live in, we manipulate. We can manipulate time and space. You are dragged along by it. We put it right equal with us so that we can do the things that we need to do when we need to do them. You are dragged along by time and space because you do not know how to manipulate it. Do you understand that? Yes. Yes, thank you. I, I, that is the best way for me to describe it. <clears throat> it is different, yes. Thank you for this message. And it's not measured in the way that you measure it. It is measured in what has been accomplished in what period of time? So, so if, if there is something that you need to change in the past, you go to the past? Wouldn't that affect we go to the past. We can go to the past and future, but not to the distant past or the distant future. It is not permitted. Only a very short period of time in the past can be uh, assigned. And only a short time in the future can be assigned to your daily prospectives. It is very difficult for you to understand because you cannot see time the way we do and space. So it is a different, difficult concept. But with your telepathy, when you become telepathic, when this species has evolved to its next level, you will be getting an inkling of how time and space works because you will notice it between yourselves as you communicate telepathically there will be an understanding of how things move without being seen and that will give you an inkling of how the universe works with time and space thank you very much thank you very much again you are welcome.